Hey guys, Derek with the Garage Door Guy. So earlier this week, I released a video that explained what you could expect when you book a service call with the Garage Door Guy from before you make that appointment to what you'll need on the phone with our customer service and dispatchers. So today, I thought it would be really cool to jump on here and do a quick video on what you can expect from the time you make that appointment to the time we show up to your house. Uh, just this is a great way for you to know what to expect from us so that you are even less caught off guard and you know exactly what to expect from us. So when you book an appointment on the phone with us, you're going to receive a text or email notification thanking you and reminding you of when that time and date is. So we do two hour windows, so you'll get a text or email notification that just says, you, thank you, you booked an appointment with the garage door guy for between Tuesday, between 12 and two o'clock. Okay, then what's gonna happen is 24 hours before that appointment, you're going to get another text or email notification, and it's just gonna simply remind you of your next day appointment. So it's gonna say, hey, as a reminder, you've got an appointment with the garage door guy between 12 to two tomorrow. Then, when our technicians are dispatched to your house, they click a button called dispatch, and it sends you a text or email notification. And all it does is simply shows you a picture of the technician that is coming to your house, but it also includes a short bio on them. And then it also provides a tracking link at the bottom of that text or email that you can click on and actually track our technicians via real time. This is just another super simple way we can make you feel a little bit more comfortable by seeing the technician before he comes to your house. But it's also an awesome way if you have to meet us while you're at lunch or at work, uh, you can figure out where we're at and how quickly you need to get home. So if we happen to get to your house and you don't show up for whatever reason, we will leave a tag on your door uh, that says we missed you. Uh, so no worries there. But if we do, if you are there and we show up, then basically what will happen is we get to your door. Uh, uh, the employee will greet you. Uh, once they get inside your garage, they're going to do a multi-point inspection on your entire garage door and motor and all of its components. And so once they get done with that, they're going to identify areas that either need attention or need fixed. And what's gonna happen then is they're gonna present you with several estimates uh, based on what they found and what your good, better, and best options are. From there, you can approve uh, whichever estimate you uh, desire. You'll sign on that estimate, and then the technician's actually gonna begin their work uh, probably that day. About 98% of our work is completed same day. Uh, in the rare and unlikely chance we don't have the parts needed to do the repair, uh, they're gonna order them and get them in, and, but they will probably have talked to you about that uh, before this point anyway. So, but once they do the repair there, uh, you're then going to pay either via cash, check, or credit card uh, and sign the invoice. Once the technician uh, leaves your house, you're then gonna get a text or email notification uh, with a review link on it. And if you're satisfied with your service, we recommend you leaving us a review, letting us know that. And if uh, something didn't go right, we ask that you give us a call and let us know so that uh, number one, we can make it right, but number two, uh, we know and so that we can train our people better. And that's just kind of what you can expect when you use us.